Hello again, I'm Rodney Reynolds and welcome to another video review. Today I'm looking at the Domino Advanced Liquid Cooling CPU Cooler. What's included is the user's manual, all the materials needed for installation, and the main unit. There are three retention backplates included. Here's the AMD backplate, Intel LGA775 backplate, and the Intel LGA1366 backplate. This sealed liquid cooling system comes completely configured with the coolant pre-installed, so there's no need for any extra installation like many other water cooling kits. By combining the water block, pump, radiator and reservoir together, coolant has simplified the traditional four component loop into just one component. This reduces the space required for installation and it really simplifies the installation process over traditional water cooling kits. The CPU water block is all copper and has a mirror finish so it will make excellent contact between it and the CPU. The block also comes with a thin coat of thermal compound which takes the guesswork out of applying it yourself. The corrugated tubing that's used is much less porous than vinyl tubing or even rubber, and hence fewer refills are required. It also doesn't crack or degrade easily. The downside to this corrugated tubing is it is not as flexible. The design life is over 7 years at 50 degrees Celsius. To achieve this, they started from scratch on a pump and developed a compact form factor version 1 ceramic bearing pump which can withstand high temperatures. The 120 mm radiator that's included has lots of fins and a quiet 120 mm fan that exhausts the warm air outside the case. Note that there's only one connection to be made which gets attached into the motherboard's 3-pin CPU fan header. There is also an LCD showing the fan speed, pump speed, and the temperature. On the side there is a mode button and pressing it will cycle through three different modes. The quiet mode which is in now, performance, and full. You can also change from Fahrenheit to Celsius by holding down the mode button for around 3 seconds. Also an alarm will sound if the fan fails. Let me stop the fan to demonstrate. Installation is very easy. First attach the water block and then mount the main unit at the back of the case where a 120mm fan would normally be installed. Note that all the materials for installation are included and it can be mounted on the new AMD or Intel based motherboards. And it will fit in most cases with a 120mm fan at the back. This product performs extremely well, is easy to install and affordable. As a matter of fact, it's around the same price as a really good air cooler, but it will outperform the air cooler. This unit though will still not outperform a custom built water cooling setup and that's to be expected. But considering the time it takes to install this unit and the cost, it has major bang for the buck. Overall, this is a 100% kick-ass product. Until next time, take care.